During these first warm-up exercises, Tassilo goes through a number of turning movements. Pay close attention to his feet. This exercise should be repeated at least 10 times before moving on to the next exercise. Here we see Tassilo with his feet together. He carries out at least 10 circular movements to the left and to the right. This exercise helps to warm up the shoulder muscles. It's important that both elbows touch at least 15 times. This wonderful warming up exercise serves the dorsal spine area of the body. Sword fighting in armor or Harnischkampf imposes a lot of strain on this area of the body. Keep your shoulders in the hunched position for at least one minute. During this exercise, Tassilo goes down on his knees and leans backwards on his elbows. He holds this position for a while and then turns on his back. For an optimal stretching effect, he stretches his arms up in the direction of his head. One of the most important of these exercises is designed for the neck muscles. Take your right hand and place it on the left side of your head. Your left arm should be stretched out in the direction of the floor. Maintain this position for at least one minute. Then a slow change to the middle. Lower your chin in the direction of your chest. Place both hands on the back of your head without exerting strong pressure. After about 30 seconds, change over to the right-hand side of your neck. Here, we'd like to demonstrate an effective method of stretching for your shoulder blades and shoulder muscles. It requires about half a minute. Stretching for the lower arms is important for anyone working with hand weapons. Tassilo uses his left hand to grip his fingers on his right hand. Then he stretches his lower right arm forward. Both arms should be stretched in this way for at least 10 seconds. Simple stretching exercises with legs apart in a wide step forward and in a low position. This is important. Train both sides and hold this position for at least 20 seconds. calf stretching exercises. Your legs are under a great deal of pressure. In order to avoid injury, stretch your calf muscles while holding this simple position and hold for 10 seconds. The straddle position. This straddle position not only exercises your groin area and the inner thigh muscles, but also helps to strengthen the lower back and seat muscles, as well as the thighs and calves. The upper part of the body should be held in a vertical position with the knees pressed outwards. Your feet should face the front. Carry out stretching slowly and then adopt a lower position. Attempt to hold this for 20 seconds. You can carry out modern healthy type push-ups in a number of positions. Here we have the knees on the floor and the upper part of the body is tilted forward. Here the hands are further forward than the shoulders. Now the hands are under the shoulders. Then under the chest. You should carry out this exercise using fists and then with 10 fingers as support. This is good for your stomach muscles. One, the navel is pressed down in the direction of the floor. Two, elbows touch the knee in an alternating fashion. 
carry out at least 50 times. Warming up exercises carried out with a short practice stick should be done before each practice bout. Tassilo gets warmed up using wide movements. Shoulder muscles should be warm for this exercise. Now another variation. The difference here is that Tassilo puts more pressure behind his swinging movements. Here, Tassilo practices an overhaul or a stroke directed downward, diagonally or vertically from above, and stops the movement at his stomach or hip level. This exercise carried out with varying power is important for control of muscles and tendons during a practice bout. Stretching while wearing armor is also possible. Practice carefully with your legs in a straddle position and the following movements as well. Move into the step forward position and hold it. Warming up in armor is a good way of preparing for a practice bout. Tassilo tensions his entire body. Changing over from one position to another helps to get the entire body warm and will improve fitness levels generally if carried out on a regular basis. And here we have the warm-up faces using a sword while wearing armor once again. The swing. And stopping a swing. <laughs> 